It's one of the smallest teams competing in Rio. Just six Palestinians will compete in the games. But for one swimmer, it's about more than medals. It's a chance to tell her story. Derek Stoffel has that. Mary El Atrash hopes to make a splash at the Olympics in Rio. The 22-year-old swimmer is one of six Palestinian athletes competing in Brazil. I'm very proud to be going to Rio and to represent Palestine and all Palestinians. It's certainly not easy for Palestinians to prepare for the Olympic Games. There are no Olympic-sized swimming pools in the Palestinian territories, so Mary practices here at the YMCA. The pool is just half the length of an Olympic-sized venue. There is no platform for her to dive off from. And she has to share the pool with the public, fitting in her training between open swim times. She practices near Bethlehem in the Israeli-occupied West Bank. Most Palestinians are barred from entering Israel, where there are larger and more modern training facilities. Because of all the difficulties that Palestinians live under, it makes it harder to practice and compete in our sports. The International Olympic Committee has invited Palestinian athletes to compete since the Games in Atlanta. Palestine making its first appearance of the Olympic It's part of a program to include participants from IOC member states who don't meet the qualifying criteria. Syria. 16 Palestinians have competed in the Summer Olympics since 1996. This Palestinian sports commentator says in Rio, going for gold is not the goal. When we go to the Olympics as Palestinians, I think it's a good chance to, uh, to, to, to represent Palestine, as I said before, uh, to tell the world that Palestine is there and Palestine one day will, uh, will be uh, uh, free. Mary al Atrash has won many awards at local and regional competitions. In Rio, she aims to set a new personal best. And what about Palestine's first medal at the Olympics? It's difficult because of the lack of resources for us here. It will be very difficult to win a medal. For Atrash and the five other Palestinian athletes, simply taking part in the Rio Games is a big win. The chance to compete under the Palestinian flag. Derek Stoffel, CBC News, Bethlehem in the West Bank.